guys. Hey, yeah. What's wrong? Hello and good morning. Welcome to being Wendy. Honestly, I am starting my vlog in the car. <laughs> I am going for a meeting with a friend of mine. Um, yeah, just for some projects I want to start working on. I am in a phase of feeling the fear and doing it anyway. If you guys know, you've been here for a while, you know that's always my mantra. I'm always telling myself I'm going to feel the fear and doing, do it anyway. And for a long time I haven't been living by that. I've been feeling the fear and just shutting down and letting my anxiety and my overthinking take over. But this time, you know what? It's do or die. So everything I've ever put my heart and mind into, I am going to pursue to the best of my ability. If it works, it works. If it doesn't, at least I have tried and failed and I will take it gracefully. Like, you know what? This one wasn't for me. I will move forward. And that's the kind of person I want to be moving forward. So this month of November, so this is... No, I do, I'm not sure when this um, vlog will go up, but if it does go up uh, before the end of November, well then good. If it doesn't, can it sour? As long as um, we're shooting and staying consistent, um, I am very. I'm in a space of my birthday. This was I turned 28 in November. Um, and since I turned like 26, 27, I've been feeling like I don't have time. Like now, if I'm failing, it's really killing me and things like that. But 28, for some reason, came with so much calmness. It came out, it didn't come with, I didn't have so much clarity, but I am willing to surrender to God and just let him, you know, lead me and at his own time do things in my life. However, while I'm waiting and, you know, you know how they say, be still and wait. And be still and know that he is God. Um, I am staying still while working on things. So that by the time he's deciding to elevate me, I will have the skills and the expertise to be elevated to the highest levels of, like to the highest levels ever. I am feeling really, oops, fuel tank is on. I am feeling really encouraged and happy this, this time around. I am so excited. I am feeling like, you know what, I can conquer. So whatever was killing me before, for some reason is not, which is weird because like up to like last month, I was just in the gutters mentally. I was feeling like, I was going through it. But yeah, it's a new week. Yesterday we had the Grand Nairobi bike race. Um, if you have follow me on on Instagram and Twitter and TikTok, you know I did some marketing for them online. Um, and yeah, we did. An, they had an amazing thing. The most beautiful thing for me about this race, I literally met guys from Uganda. This was the highlight of my day. So towards the end of the day, we're going to now watch, um, to now listen to the results and everything. And then this guys from Uganda come and they're like, hi Wendy, we've been following you on Twitter. We've been seeing what you're doing. And we wanted to inquire about a few things. And I was like, Yo, my work is going beyond borders. I in you, Woo! literally, if, I don't see myself as someone who has a say or is a big deal in the cycling industry. But now I'm realizing, even when I'm looking down on myself, God is really just doing his thing. Like in Ienda too, like the work is just... So now that's even giving me more affirmation to just keep trusting and believing and pushing. Because while you're struggling and suffering and crying, your work is actually speaking for itself 
So I was very proud of myself when I had that. I was very, I felt very encouraged. We exchanged contacts. I hope I'll be able to cycle to Kampala sometime. I don't know next year or the next or the year after. I say that because I have a whole itinerary for next year, and I don't want to exhaust myself. That is excluding some of my personal um, goals, like my travel itinerary for next year is really booked so i'm just hoping and praying um things work out as i plan them to be and then i'll be able to cycle to like across counties and more even to the western part of the country more than yeah because nimenda i've gone to malindi so meaning i've passed through kinavui kinakibwezi i've gone to mombasa i've gone to malindi i've gone to naivasha severally i've done i haven't cycled to sagana but i've been there twice I've cycled to Nyeri. I've cycled to Nyeri. Um, I've actually cycled to Sagana when I was going to Nyeri. Like, I cycled through. Yeah, I just didn't um, stop and sleep in Sagana. So, I have actually cycled to Sagana. Um, where, what else have I done? I have gone to... I'm actually going to Gilgil in December. That one, I plan to bring a better vlog than I have been um, doing before. Um, just because I am learning how to edit better, so I'm learning how to shoot better. Um, yeah, because I want to carry you guys on these tours with me. They're so exciting, and I really want you in on the. I want you guys in on the fun. This is girl. Like, it's not a breeze. Like, I don't want people to think of me and just say, oh, this girl, you know, is this. No, I'm just a normal girl. I started this thing as a joke. And I'm having a blast while at it. So I'm really excited about um, Gilgil. I don't know if I'm fit enough, but I want to start training for it. It's in maybe two, three weeks. So I want to just be ready. It's actually in two weeks. <laughs> but I can't be ready in two weeks because it's not such a hectic um, route. The only hectic part is... Come on, to my mind, you know. The hectic part in Akwangapo... Mount Long or not. It's normally a very long climb. Very long, stressful climb. But anyway, that aside, um, so yeah, let's go to town. Let's um, meet this friend of mine, this beautiful girl. Hey, it's Pauline, my, my tripod. Is it a tripod really? My camera stand for the car fell down. Uh, but that's it for me. What a sunny. I go meet my friend and then and then I'll see you guys. I hope I'll be able to get the courage to vlog a little bit when we're at the restaurant. Because we're going to town I can't vlog. So and I haven't been to town in a really long time. Like a channel, okay, short, short, short. Like literally before like <laughs> at time I haven't been to town in such a long time. I need I barely leave the house. I struggle so much with leaving the house. I like to do work that keeps me in the house and I'm able to just do deliver quick quick work. But for me to be able to get to where I want to be, I need to leave the house a little bit more. Not a little, I really need to do leave the house um so often so that I'm able to get some things done, I'm able to meet some people and yeah, get closer to my goals. So I hope I will continue with this energy and with this um I called my cousin the other day telling her depression in me ends <laughs> You know, I'm making it light, but I'm starting to actually really feel good. Good enough to call people to visit, good enough to say, Hi, I'm sorry I've not been a good friend. I've just really been going through it and I hope you understand. And when I can I will make it up to you. Um, because I am not yet there but I am just trying to figure my things out first so that I'm able to accommodate everyone else and I hope that can be understood in this age and time we'll be talking a lot about mental health because I'm really just trying to maneuver that as well my mental health but yeah and I don't know if you guys can see this t-shirt I wish you could and I can post a video here or a picture of my beautiful t-shirt it's actually um, part of merchandise I had started designing way way back um this one is rich rich auntie um there's quite some designs i'm going to just put them down below links down below of the designs that i have 
and then you guys can buy them from me if you want yeah um yeah so there's rich auntie and then there's baby girl for life there's more coming up but these two are the ones that are ready designed so you just tell me your size place an order and then we get it delivered to you anyway thank you so much i'll see you guys in a minute in a while in a while so i've just finished my meeting <coughs> i'm in the car mm. My meeting went well. I'm in the car. I am having some Jessica Rye from some place in town called Tamu Tamu. It could opposite that, um, the neighbors that on Kimathi Mall. No, Kimathi House. Kimathi House. The next name is the supermarket. That's there. Across the road, there's a there's this car joint for like to sell so any food. My friend took me for just a few snacks. So you know, and I keep company right now in the car. I am waiting for printed copies of this book I have I worked on a while back. I wrote a children's book and got printed. Do you call it publishing? So I am, yeah, getting them today. I am so excited, like. Last week I was just crying about how I feel like I'm not doing much. So someone came and I got shy. <laughs> so yeah, the book is out. The book is out. And I'm anxious. And I was saying last week when I was how I'm feeling like my life is going stagnate. But this week I'm having such a pumped Monday. And I'm so hyped for a lot of things. I didn't go to like Monday. What? <laughs> I feel so good. I feel really, really good. But yeah, so I'm waiting for those books. Then, if you follow me on Instagram, you'll be able to see it. I'll probably open a page just for my books that I intend to write. I can't even believe I'm saying this. Like, this is crazy. Like, I'm man. And they. <laughs> I feel, I know I feel like I'm such a small girl and some of the things I do, even me, it's like I sit back and I'm like, did I really, like I was able to pull that off, it may not be big to other people, but to me it's like crazy, it's like, and I'm such, I'm the biggest dreamer, I'm like, I want to be writing books. I want to be doing this without knowing how to start and everything. And I just do things and sometimes they just happen. And I'm just like, how? Of course I know how, but like, yeah. Anyway, Minko happy. Um, I think I need to buy some water. I'm very thirsty. I want to buy like a liter of water. Maybe I said I do not. But while I wait for this guy to bring me my books, because I want my books, I need my books. But anyway, I'm looking cute, and I'm happy seeing a makeup because I'm about to draw in a nitwanga. I'm sweating like now, so it comes to draining. So it's such a good thing I didn't have I didn't have makeup on because I'd just be feeling nasty. But yeah, beauty looks like this. Hi guys. Hey, yeah, what's wrong? Hi, guys, I am in my room <laughs> at home, and uh, this is the next day. So, Jana and Dr. Yanzai vlog, and then this is the next day. So, I wanted to show you this book that I've done. This one, Buhila takes on cycling. I don't know if. I don't know. I hope, yeah. There. It's just a children's book I wrote a year ago, like over a year ago. I've just been scared to print it. So now I've printed it. And I hope by the time this video goes up, I'll be able to be selling them. So you'll find a link down below for the page and how you can get it. Um, it gives me like Napata goosebumps just thinking about putting it out there. Like goosebumps, like. Like good goosebumps and scared, like I'm terrified. 
and it's just it's beautiful to see honestly that I'm going back to feeling the fear and doing it anyway. My shoe rack is for some reason so empty. I want to fill it up. I don't I'm going to look for my shoes all over the house. Fill it up. If I don't have shoes, more reason for me to work hard to buy more shoes. Yeah. I think it'll come I don't know what happened. I'm a pull up in taking my shoes. I don't know. But anyway, so today is a slow day. Um, I struggle a bit with slow days because I feel like I really beat myself up when I'm not productive and things like that. Like in Nimeamua too, even when I feel bad, I'm going to give myself a few hours to just feel it and then get out of that rut instead of getting into a whole like day, I'm a, like two days, like a whole week like that because that's what used to happen like i procrastinate then i feel bad for procrastinating and then i hate myself look at my sewing machine i need to do that i need to i'm making my bed not making passive but changing my bedding um just do, like, i'm trying to do small small things that make me feel very nice and excited so whenever i change my bedding i feel so like renewed i feel new and i also need to do my laundry it's actually it's afternoon. I'm going to do my laundry now. So the day has been slow. Um, something I was really hoping to have gotten done by now, I jawak. Or rather, there's no feedback. So it's just, woo, I was so close. But then now it's like, it's pulling away from me. And I'm just like, you know what? In this time, I'm just going to go back to trying to do work instead of just feeling like I can't get things done. But yeah. So today is a cycling day. I need to get ready in two. So I need two hours to to clean up, to do everything I need to do. Have some lunch. Um, to get into my cycling kit. Um, I also have to do skincare before cycling because if I don't, but yeah, do some get some nini for my cycling kit, and then I'm going to be cycling. Hopefully it doesn't rain. Need to a cycle your time like at. I cycle with a group called Mama Cycling every Tuesday. So, yeah, that's the group I'm going to cycle with today. Um, we normally have tea and something after, like, chatty chatty. But sometimes I'm realizing it's taking a lot of my time. It's taking time. It's taking me away from my child. And sometimes it's I can miss it. I can. Some nilkonga na fomo, naskianga fomo. Kwanza it comes to like cycling, like hangouts. I feel so much fomo, but then I'm I'm just going back to, because you see, even with my friends, like my friends who are not cyclists, my girlfriends, I never used to have. I used to have fomo bad, 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 bad fomo back in the day, and then I just got out of it and told myself I'm not a concert person. I'm not a this person. Sometimes I can't afford a date. Sometimes, and it's just guys, I can't afford it this time or guys. I'm not in a place where I can or guys as in I'll just be open about how I feel or guys I, I wasn't really on board with this one can we change can we do this and it always works but squeeze at Tunani every day so most times I try not to miss the girl hangouts but now with cycling I see these guys like two times a week I love them but then now it's I'm trying to create time for my work myself and my child so unonoki focusivo in a bit difficult. So this tea is a Tuesday. Some Tuesdays I'm going to be missing out. Some I'm going to be going when I just need to when I need to fill my cup. When I can't, I won't be going. But yeah, yeah, But as of now, I just want to get a few things done. Yeah, but anyway, let's clap for me for the book. Yay! So the book, let me tell you. So the children's book is actually Influenced by my daughter's um, experiences of life. So small, small things that she's done get me into my creative world. And I just write small, small books. It's actually a really small book, like 15 pages. Um, yeah, and then I just put it out there and I just hope for the best. Now that's what I've done. And I'm anxious. I'm extremely anxious. I'm like, what if I don't sell the copies that I have? But I'm just like, God puts this in me he will see me through it so that's what we are doing but yeah basically that's that so i don't know if i'll be able to carry you guys with me Kwanini, but let's just try and get some things in the house done i don't know i hope i'll be able to carry you with me because sometimes i'm just feeling some type of way but anyway 
um also i'll be trying to do vlogmas so i don't want to really announce it so i think this is going to be the first first or second vlogmas video um because i just have a few things lined up but yeah and also want to just figure out a space in my room where i can be shooting properly because i want to do like styling videos i have a unique style it's not too common or rather some things that appeal to me may not appeal to people so i just want to be shooting for myself so i'm not sure if this is a good background but anyway i am working on a lot of things at the same time i just need to give myself grace and be consistent so for me to be consistent it needs me to be at the right like the right space of mind yeah Thank you so much. Anyway, so I hope to kutane before I'll end this vlog with you guys. Maybe when I'm changing into the cycling kits or something. But I don't like long videos that are too long. So we'll just be making them brief, straight to the point, and awesome. But anyway, so today is Tuesday. This week, I don't have much. But on the weekend, I have my daughter is doing... She has an extravaganza in school that I'm so excited to go watch. Um, because she's been playing the violin for like almost two years now. And I really want to see it because I've, I haven't seen it. They just sent me videos and whatnot, but I like I really want to see her do it. And I'm so excited about that. Alafu, my friend passed the bar, so also I think we need this week. We'll need to make her a gift, so we'll figure that one out. So anyway, see you guys in a few. Let's let's clean up. bonus is this pending maragwe kama na kama nyama inge kuwa hapo inge kuwa inge kuwa maragwe hmm lakini no pende hmm na penda nengu kama nani maragwe nengu ni the worst na juu dada na semanga yoye zikula nengu kwa sababu Atuwa likola sana. Enoyes. Eh. Ndengu. Ndengu. Alafu upate mawe ndani unasianga kupiga nduru. Wewe. Bali nafanyaka na ukoka ukola hizo vitu. Mimi sipendi ndengu kabisa. Lazima tu utauma hiyo mawe. Tena usipende ndengu utauma. Hi guys, it is, I, I think I'm going to end the vlog here. So this has just been basically me talking to you in my car at home and whatnot. I am not, I don't want to, I, I can't vlog in town, down in Likwa town. Um, I didn't want to vlog my space today because I was just feeling like it. And I think I'm going to just be giving myself grace regardless. Right now, Nico ready. Um, as you can see, I'm wearing my cycling kit by Five Star Africa. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, it's a Kenyan brand. Um, and right now, and uh, I'm going to pick my my babies, my daughter and my brother, and rush back, leave the car, cycle to where to where we are starting from. Inaka kuchangesha, but I'm hopeful that it won't. Naskia tu yani, like I can see the clouds forming, but it looks like they're forming, not forming, forming, and it looks like that mvua for like a few minutes and it's over. So I hope that's the kind of rain that's going to come, because my I've just put my raincoat in the washing machine. I don't know, my phone went, I don't know, it did something weird. So I was saying I did manage to change my bedding. I feel a little bit better than I was earlier. Um, but what can I say? Mm, sorry, I'm just a little bit distracted. Yes, I'm feeling better than I was earlier. And I think it's just, you know, some some of these days are, yeah, I'm normal. It happens. I'm allowing myself to feel the things that I do feel. I think that I've said earlier. Now, I'm going to ride bike. 
and I know that motivation at yeah, the group and everything will make me feel so good and so much better so that's why I've signed up I've checked on my friend she's told me she's going to cycle so that's given me energy inside and also my partner my partner my business partner in the cycling we have a cycling um, company it's called by Scaly Safaris so that's a group you'll see me cycling with a lot outside Nairobi by skilly safaris um we just tour the country on our bicycles i think i've said this before on our channel but yeah so if you're new here i do run a bicycle business i mean a bicycle touring business and we just travel we've so far we've just done to, uh, tours um within kenya and the biggest tour we had was the one we did to malindi which I gladly did from Nairobi to Malindi 634 kilometers four days I do have a lot of content on that so it a kujai vlogmas I'll be posting some of the tours on vlogmas that are because I can't make a so much anxiety like I'm shooting content but I am so terrified of like even like removing them from the GoPro and putting them on my laptop is just giving me so much stress and anxiety and then like my laptop is image and you know sometimes when you just feel like small small things zina resist until you start feeling like you're almost hopeless or you just feel bad you feel like it's such a big thing but some someone recently has been trying to help me when they were trying to help me get out of that um rat they were just telling me let's take a step at a time just do one small thing one small thing and i think that has really helped me um divide everything i feel into workable things to the point that you actually sort out the whole thing that ilikuwa na kusumbua kumbe ilikuwa small small steps i wasn't taking so that's what i'm focusing on uh so i'll just try to get something for extra storage and then focus on more vitu kama hizo focus um no more on shooting and posting and posting and posting because practice makes improvements and that's what i'm looking for i'm hoping by january to talk to me rudy back to system apa kwa hii channel yetu when i say back to system i mean to talk on a good numbers of views oops it could you lose this is one of the things i'll fix because i'm realizing um if i'm in the car a lot and sometimes i just feel like i can nikipoteo ni ya creativity me i'm going with it and then daily time i'll have like creators block i'll just be switching off like even when i switch off i'll still have content to post even on bad days and i'm working towards not having bad days for long periods See, i think we've talked about it akin on hapa kuna traffic i'm just i wanna cry because what is wrong with this my child's school ekona issues are parking other things are really good like they treat them well and what not but issues of parking they i just can't wait for them to close school honestly it's even more for me than it is for the kids ni mechoka na routine i'm seeing someone is leaving so that's a good thing i can go squeeze myself in that car please but yeah so as i as i was saying um yeah i'll just keep i'll i'm handling one small thing at a time until things start just flowing and i think that would be a really good strategy for me and a lot of the things that i do so that i'm able to keep the my car and my life running yeah meanwhile let me just get out go get the kids and with that i think the next video will start from here or rather will start from this cycling if it's the next one but a video will start from this but yeah thank you so much for tuning in don't forget to like comment share, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't and i'll be back with more videos